the International Scan on Pedestrian and Bicyclist Safety and Mobility, sponsored by FHWA, ASHTO, and NCHRP. We visited Malmo and Lund in Sweden, Copenhagen and Knoxkopf in Denmark, Berlin and Potsdam in Germany, Bern and Winterthur in Switzerland, and London and Bristol in the United Kingdom. The first city we visited was Malmo, Sweden. Sweden places a national priority on bicyclist safety and has a national database linking hospital crash and injury data with road safety data, allowing them to determine where bicyclist crashes are taking place and what countermeasures are needed. In Malmo, they have community bikes available for citizens to use. This cycle track was built on an old railroad corridor, and the underpass cost $4 million and was specifically built to allow cyclists to have a safe, grade-separated crossing of the major, busy arterial streets above. This is a common practice in Malmo. Bicycle traffic signals are quite common. Note both the near side and far side signal. These signals operate on their own exclusive phasing. Also note the orange handrail that allows bicyclists to come to a stop but not have to dismount from their bike. Blue pavement markings are used where cycle tracks cross major roads. Note the raised crosswalk and pedestrian refuge island on this four-lane arterial. The crosswalk is used by both pedestrians and bicyclists with good motorist compliance. Note the alternating white and black checkerboard markings, which are made out of cobblestones.